Hey YouTube, it's Alf Wolf, and I'm back again with the second video of the day back in GTA. <laughs> so today I'm actually going to show you guys how you can get a very special vehicle called the Hearse. Now this is for those of you that don't know where to get it and, and pretty much so on. Now what you're going to need is you're going to need a friend that already has the hearse and I'll show you if I call it in. Let's call her in. Right here. So it's called the Romero hearse. Yes mechanic, please deliver it right now. So what you're going to need again is a friend or a person that already has it and well, what it is, is just it's pretty unique and lightly modified. This is mine, really. Yeah, I haven't touched this thing in, like, eons. So, your friend's gonna need to have one of these, and... You're gonna have to follow him in the hearse, and... You gotta drive all the way to the funeral home. Now, the funeral home is located over... Oh, shit, I think I'm gonna die. Okay, never mind. Okay, I'm not gonna die. So the funeral home is uh, where is it? Down that road. Right here. I think it's right here. I think so. Let's just figure it out. I I don't keep track of the map. Sorry guys. I've been doing way too much GTA. I can't keep track of the map. So you're gonna need to drive all the way to the funeral home and. Having one of these increases the chance, and it will almost guarantee the spawn if you have one or two more. Now, this thing is uh, pretty fast, but kind of disrespectful if you had someone really in the back, of course. Respect the dead. Respect the deceased. Get, there, get out of the way! Hey, uh, am I going the right way? Please tell me I'm going the right way. I'm going to go on the right road. Oh, there it is. Right there. The, the green building right straight ahead. So if you got the hearse, it will spawn, it might spawn one either in this parking lot or in front of the building. If it doesn't spawn, have your friend drive away from, oh, here we go. Here we go. Here's one. So if it doesn't spawn, just have your friend drive quite a distance away from the funeral home and then head right back. It'll spawn it. And you can get in this vehicle, but be advised, there is a slight chance that, well actually it's a decent chance you will get a bounty just for stealing this car. You can modify this thing pretty much like a standard vehicle. You can have tinted windows, upgraded engine, turbocharger, armor, brakes... Mainly just the works for a standard vehicle. I'm not sure if I'm going to get a bounty, but I'm pretty sure I am. Because there's a chance on that. The more you steal vehicles, the higher the chance. I think. This depends on the value of the car. The game will randomly generate you a bounty. And so there you have it. How to get a hearse. <laughs> so if you guys like this video, and I hope you find it helpful. Now this video is only if you guys suddenly tune in to my video instead of seeing all the other per people's videos on how to get this. It's just um, from my point of view, just saying. Yeah, so if you guys are tuning in this video, I hope you find this helpful. This is Alpha Wolf, and uh, I'm just going to keep playing GTA until I drop. <laughs> so without further ado, survive GTA and get rich. <laughs>